Good evening, this is Steve Fletcher. Progress video of the, uh, this temple being built. It's inside the William, uh, William Penn, underneath. Where's sick lag at? Wow. Let's see this thing here. This is a very interesting piece of artwork. Somebody's look, like he's looking ahead. Yeah, you, know, you have your hand on your head, you're covering the sun, trying to look that way. So that's a, a scorpion sting. And that's a bird. I don't know if that's an eagle. I mean, the guy's face is kind of unusual.
So that's what it is, huh? That's the, uh, this the giant Nephilim, uh, the uh, AI mixed. It's pretty crazy. So it's the spirit of enterprise. Oh, I see. So he's looking into the future with fearless and eager eyes, as vigorous as a young man to run a race and end up at 17th and race. Theodore Roosevelt. It's our nation. Glorious in youth and strength, looks into the future with fearless and eager eyes. So that's what it is. He's fearlessly looking into the future because he sees the mark of the beast system is coming up. The mark of Cain. It's being born. It's a birthmark. A moor, just like the park right there, the park right at 17th and and race is a moor, a mo Roma, or AM, whichever one it is, Patria, and it's the tree of life. This is the tree that Dr. Gene Kim was talking about, the... Uh, the evil tree inside of the garden. This is a tree that I, I, I think God might have been talking about something like that. Man, look at that. Welcoming to freedom. Hear the free spirit of mankind at length throws its last fetters off, throws its last fetters off, and who shall place a limit to the giants, unchained strength, or curb his swiftness in the forward race? William Bryant. With malice towards none, with charity for all, with firmness in the right, as God gives us to see the right, let us strive to finish the work we are in, Abraham Lincoln. Before before with with and then without without is the uh to heaven, uh, promised roll.
their bands have broken asunder the chains because that's a chain it's a when you're born with an evil nature they'll consider that like the chains that you're that uh, they came seeking freedom So they came seeking freedom. I don't know, it looks, doesn't look too safe. The immigrant. There you go. So naturally you got one side over there. Plowman is right here. He's the plowman. They broke the land. They 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 broke the land. So these are the ones that broke the land for harvest. What are they harvesting? Well, they searched the earth for treasure. The miner. Panning the continent. America is west and the wind blowing. America is a great word in the snow. A way of white bird. The rain falling a shining thing in the mine and the gulls call. So this is the circle. Going from... That looks inappropriate, doesn't it? So this is going from male on the other side to female. She's only so smaller because she's kneeling. Her leg is like buckled. And, um, and so she has the ax in her hand. So that kind of gives it away as to what's happening on, what's happening down in this in this area here because this is the revolving like it's the revolving side the feed Co totally converted up the valleys and gorge gorges are white with the covered wagons moving out toward the west and the new free land That is frightening. Yep. It's the way he wanted to roll. He's just rolling with it. So these are the ones, the plowmans. There's a reason why they're plowmans. These are the ones that broke the land for the harvest. Just, uh, just tedia. Just it to you. Serpent in the bath. No, water. Fountain cup. Prudentia. Prudent. See the sword? The 
serpent being pierced. The all-seeing mirror. So on this side, they have the uh, Abundantia, lion, the sun, the woman, the shield, the bird, shield. Potestus. So that would be the hand of God, the boat, Noah's Ark, Tree of Life. Coming in the clouds. Well, the elite just gave away their host body system in a um, just inside of a, a statue alone. You think anybody else looks at that? Like, yeah, I, I know what that is. It's a uh, the host body. That's the giant Nephilim race, the giants. Statue. I've seen that before and I thought, ah, what? Uh, and then you see it again and, you, and then you see like what it, what it is. Because there's both sides, it's like the tree, the knowledge of good and evil. It's the knowledge of both. Because that, that knowledge of good and evil it's basically just, in everybody's mind, it's really, you are both right. Like in everybody's mind, everybody's right, but somebody else is wrong. Why do you even need to be right? Like what's the point? I wonder how many people that I've walked by or scooted by that were in a mask, like a real live, a real live mask that you can't, you can't tell the difference whatsoever as you're walking by people.
Sure is nice down here. It's actually the first time I ever really went down here to take this trail. Probably in my entire life. I don't ever remember coming down here. Just been too busy. Busy, busy. Everything's busy. This soul just give up. He doesn't ever give up, does he? Soul goes all the way to the end. Because he came in with a mask. Uh, I think he was acting like Samuel. I read. Uh, yeah, Samuel. Yeah, we work with Because he called up that woman. And that woman. The woman was, uh, she, she told Saul what, what she saw coming up from the earth. Guys, stop talking to Saul. Saul calls the, the diviner. She shows him. Wait, I can't let that go. John B. B John B. Kelly, Olympic champion in singles, 1920 doubles. The amount of knowledge that you need to uh, to understand the things that take place is a lot. That is damn cool right there. And these people are just enjoying their lives. I don't know what the hell I've been doing. I, I've been sleeping, apparently. Apparently I hit my head and I did hit my head when I was a kid a couple times. One time I was like seven and I think I was playing, I don't know, that game that kids play when they're seven years old outside. And I, it was the first and only time that I ever just straight passed out and hit the floor and banged my head up on these like stairs. If you're playing this game around stairs. There's probably like five or six kids there. It's not that I fell on my head when I was a child. 
but I definitely banged my head. So, something what happened there. I'm just trying to learn. I try to learn. No matter what, when bringing a, a divine woman, like a, a medium, like the, the type that the type that talks with dead people, I know the perception of that, like that's evil and it's witchcraft and all that. But uh, when you're so, aren't you supposed to talk to the living dead people? The ones that are dead, spiritually they're dead. So when you call them up, a bunch of them, because they got called up, they uh, they they were with Christ in that kingdom that very day when that when that took place. Those familiar spirits, because the familiar spirits, they're very familiar. They sound familiar, they look familiar. I know one that always said he was uh, King David, uh, Ben Yosef, Yeshua, Yes, Hamalak Shamak. And he makes a good case for, you know, what he knows. But I just think it's funny, kind of like, Hopping on YouTube four years ago, never really knowing the Bible, just reading passages here and there. And then I come into YouTube world and I, and I find a bunch of characters that are playing these people out. What an honor. To just invite myself in, whether you like it or not. And a lot of you don't still, but a lot of you did have a lot of problems with me. And then over time, because that's all it is, it, it's time, consistency, and if you can't see what I'm showing you, then you just Maybe you've not haven't watched enough videos, or maybe you haven't just paid real attention to it. Or maybe it's not for you to see. But it'll benefit people in the end. That's all I really know. So by talking to the to the dead. That was a time where it actually uh, did something because of Saul. The Saul's always blaming everybody for everything. All the way to the very end, when his life was taken. And then um, and at that time, where did he go?